y coordinate positive in third quadrant this is on negative x axis and negative y axis so both coordinates are negative and in this quadrant this is positive direction of x axis this is negative direction of x axis so x positive and y negative so considering these points and this graph you have to fill up this table that is your activity now these points are given minus 3 2 minus 3 4 minus 3 5 minus 3 minus 4 here x coordinate is everywhere minus 3 means all these points should be on one line which represents minus 3 one vertical line which represents minus 3 so this minus 3 is on x axis and all these points they are on the same line now just observe that if possible draw line through this point so we got one line on this now state characteristics of this now what is the characteristic of this graph so this graph is parallel to y axis and what is common characteristics in coordinates of these points now if we consider all these coordinates then x coordinate is constant so we can say that if x coordinate is con constant then all these points are on a line parallel to y axis so the equation of this line we can say that it is x is equal to constant as x is equal to constant every point x coordinate of every point on this line is constant so this line is parallel to y axis now observe this here 3 minus 2 4 minus 2 5 minus 2 minus 3 minus 2 1 minus 2 means y coordinate is constant everywhere so all these points they are on y equal to minus 2 line this horizontal line all these points are on this line again from these all points we can draw a straight line and this straight line is parallel to x axis means if a line is parallel to x axis then y coordinate of all these points is constant so the equation of this line we can say that y is equal to b where b constant if y coordinate is, is constant then line is parallel to x axis and if x coordinate constant then line is parallel to y axis every point if we consider every point on x axis its x y coordinate is zero because every point on x axis its distance from y axis is zero and therefore y coordinate of every point on x axis is zero therefore equation of x axis is taken as y equal to zero similarly on y axis every point if we consider every point on this and coordinates of the points then here this represents a zero on x axis and therefore x coordinate of every point on y axis is zero and therefore the equation of y axis is considered as x is equal to 0. Now we will revise this. When x is equal to 0, this equation represents y axis. y equal to 0, this equation represents x axis. x is equal to constant, this represents a line parallel to y axis. y is equal to constant, it represents line parallel to x axis. Now consider this graph. 1, 3, 2, 4, minus 2, 0, minus 